So hi everybody and uh, let's see how to create with Kinter uh, an image browser and uh, the last in the last post we used a label to show the image and now we want to use uh, the canvas. Let's see the result. It's just like uh, the one we did before but the only difference is that we are using a, a image browser. You see here the first image is bigger and it takes just uh, the sides of the image and it uh, makes the canvas just like the sides of the image in this version. Maybe we could change it later and then maybe we in the next, uh, in another post, in another video, we want to make something different, something we want to add the chance to add some images or draw on the image on the image and save it. For now it is just a file browser so let's uh, start again the code and see how I made it. Let's save it as image browser number number two maybe dot by and first of all you get import uh, tkinter of course SDK that is a module to create a graphic user interface and then I want to import also glob that will be used to take the files in the folder and uh, then I'm going to create a uh, the classic window with tk.tk with this tk class and then at the end the the main loop as always to um, to get the user interactions then I wanna uh, let's fix the root geometry to see the sides of the window that it will have at the start and let's make it maybe uh, you know 800 of uh, width and uh, 600 of height I could also do plus 10 um, refer to the screen and the plus uh, let's no oh, plus uh, 500 to put it into the middle or something like that and plus a 50 from from the top so let's see where it goes it goes here and uh, on my screen you can adjust it on your maybe I can go like this okay kind of middle of the screen and um, then I'm gonna to uh, create my list box where I'm gonna to put the files and so I'm gonna use the class list box and put it, uh, attach it to the root, and then I'm gonna just simply use the path, the path method to see this uh, this list. There it is. But now we also want that this list will has a fixed uh, width, so that it doesn't change and is quite visible. And then I wanna pack it to the left. Okay, let's see it. Here it is on the left, but wanna see it better. Wanna make it. Wanna make it that is uh, it fill both uh, the width and the height of the of the screen. So we will use this decay variable that is both. And then also when we expand the window, we want it to be expandable. No, we don't want to be expandable. Let's put it to zero. We can also there it is. So it will. Uh, stay there it will just uh, follow the height and uh, now that we made this um, we are going to um, to insert our file insert files so I wanted to go here and create In insert file function that will uh, for um, let's say uh, file name in glob dot glob so all the file that ends in uh, PNG will be inserted in list box so list box insert from the the end so append it. Uh, I want a file name. Let's run it. Insert. We need the T here. Here are our files. Now we want to show them in here and uh, 
we want to put a canvas there so we want to do canvas equal tk dot canvas instead of a label like we did in the last episode and uh, now we want the width of this uh, object here uh, we want it to be we are going to configure it uh, later now I want to just make it visible even if probably it will not be visible we could make it I think uh, uh, BG equal black should work no it doesn't it doesn't work because here something went wrong okay there it is and okay let's copy this tk buff and okay so now it it become black let's put it gray if you want Okay, now you can see there is our canvas and now let's create a function that we are first of all I'm gonna do a a bin here when something to happen when we select a file and so we are going to use a list box select so when we select when the user select the file it will show the image it will go to into this function here show mg and uh, I think I get to put here an event thing if you don't want to get an error and then I'm gonna to take the 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 number uh, of the of this of the list box selection I mean if, if I select the first item it will be the number will be zero the number of the selected item okay so if I want to take instead the text of the of the item um, I will just use file name maybe if I have used this variable somewhere here inside but it's a local so file name so I can use it will be equal to listbox.get and the n uh, item the item number n and then I will get the image and create this object with photo image that Tkinter has that let you load a file um, by its name and so we will load the uh, that image into this object and now I'm gonna get the width of the image that will I will use it later and so image dot width is the method to get it let's double it and let's make it height wanna get also the height let's put it here I could have done also something like W and H equal uh, so if you prefer and then I'm gonna to um, canvas dot I'm gonna store the the image into this variable because otherwise it will be deleted by the college by the garbage collector and so you will not you will not be able to see it uh, you won't be able to see it and then let me also print to the console the file name uh, just to see what I'm doing and uh, then I'm gonna do file uh, canvas config I want to change the width to W and the height of the canvas so they did it, it fits the the image uh, height and uh, width and height and then I want to uh, load the image into the canvas with the, with this function canvas um, create a e image and I want to put it at zero 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 as coordinates here or where to start the image and then I will use the image equal emg that is this object here and anchor 
equal tk northwest north west to attach it to the to the left practically so let's see what happens okay we cannot uh, see the image because here there are a couple of um, of errors here image here and list box this box select here we need it to adjust this one it's list box select so now we are able to see the images and so that's all that's how to use uh, canvas instead of label to make uh, to see the images and remember to put this canvas dot image equal image to because without this you see that we cannot see the image instead if we use it uncomment it you see that we can use it so uh, that's how to do it and the next time we will be make something to change also the image and save them with the new uh, with the changes thank you